So, check this out, people. Today is Friday, and both AMC and GME did really well yesterday. GME reached $51, maybe higher. AMC went up to $6 and change. Unfortunately, if you didn't take advantage of this spike, you may not be able to take advantage of it later on today, on Friday, because we all know that when these stocks spike, the very next day they tank, the very next day, without giving you a chance to either recover your losses or take your gains, because after the stock immediately squeezes or spikes, we all know how the stock tanks or drops the very next day. And the only people who are making money on AMC and GME are those people who are selling it, not holding it, not diamond handling. If you're diamond handling AMC and GME, you're going to lose everything. If you haven't learned your lesson already from three weeks ago, three years ago, how these stocks spike and then they tank, then you're going to lose your money. Just ask Roaring Kitty who bought millions of dollars worth of call options. The only people who are making money are those who are trading the stock, not those who are holding it. Everybody knows that these stocks aren't going to the moon. If they spike high enough where you can make millions, thousands, hundreds of thousands, my advice to you is you don't have to be a financial advisor to understand that if you're making 700% on a stock, if you don't sell it, you're just a freaking idiot. There's just no other way to put it. These stocks are not long-term investments. So in the end, you have to get your money. If you don't, you're not going to take advantage of these opportunities. I mean, everybody knows that the only people who have made money on AMC and GME are those people who sold. And those people who claim that these stocks are going to the moon aren't getting anywhere. They just continue to hold and hold and hold and miss out on the opportunity to get their money. So in the end, people, I guarantee you when the market opens up today at 9.30, the spikes that we had yesterday during regular market hours, which is rare, everybody knows that these stocks both tend to spike during pre-market hours or after market. And when the market spikes during regular market hours, you have to take advantage of that. You have to because that's a rare thing, especially with AMC and GME. And if you don't take your profits during those regular market hours when the both stocks are doing well, you're gonna miss out on the opportunity. So in the end, people, don't be stupid. Take the example of Roaring Kitty, who's buying options, call options, and selling at a profit, and those who are doing the same thing. Everybody wants to claim that these stocks are going to the moon, and the only losers are those who are sitting in that rocket waiting for these stocks to go to the moon. This is why they haven't been able to capitalize on these squeezes, because they're just breaking even when the stock, GME, hits $40, $50. They're just breaking even because a lot of these people formed in at the top. And those who held through the reverse split on AMC are just hoping for the stock to go up to at least $100 a share, just so that they can break even because $100 a share on AMC for those who held through the reverse split is only $10. So in the end, people, you got to get your money. Don't believe the hype. Don't be stupid. Don't get caught up in this nonsense of irresponsible YouTubers who keep telling you to buy and hold and not to sell. If they don't want to sell, hey, that's on them. If you want to sell, hey, that's on you. The point is you have to trade smart. You cannot go online and take people's advice who you've never met, who you don't know, who are simply trying to use you so that you can bail them out because they're stuck on the top. So in the end, people get your money.